Right, I'm listening to Killswitch Engage. I picked Rose of Sharon because it's one of my favourites of their older stuff. And I've also picked, just before we listen to the actual video, I think I mentioned in the last one about um, how Adam sort of plays his guitar between songs and stuff before each song. And I, this was one that I, I was sort of referring to. It's blonde kids against dark-haired kids and there's like four black guys out there. Wow, nice ass! Dude. It's just quite also cool to see how they how they are with the crowd. Crap! I can actually see your breakfast. Just stand up. Alright! Are you ready to do this? This bear. Are you ready? Because I know he does that quite a lot. On the California! Quite good, Bodies in uh, motion! Uh, I just probably listen to it anymore. Let's actually listen to the actual song. And this is it. Rose of Sharon. And obviously, this is sort of a song about losing someone in your life, and also I think this is him referring to his mother. The actual meaning behind the song, but obviously for you know, to other people, it can be anyone. Also, what proves just how old this song is, because I think this is literally one of the year YouTube like existed, and you can tell by the video quality. And also the vocals that Howard sort of switch between with Kill Switch is really good because obviously he's got those harsh thrash vocals and he's got his clean vocals which are really really which I prefer but yeah. <laughs> And I think this is why I remember the comments also being like, it doesn't make much sense because how are they playing like the electric guitars and stuff? But this is just classic early or mid 2000s video metal videos, so it is what it is. A little smirk that Howard does. That's why these sort of bands and songs have like a special place in my heart with some of these ones because certain lyrics, especially in the older stuff, like applied and got me through tough times in life. So I don't think the the bands that have that I'm never gonna say a bad word about because definitely um, vocalists like Howard 
won't hear a bad thing said by me. This all, I mean, I, I think this is, is this Adam that's singing this bit? But this is also just showing how well it can sort of be in these songs with some clean, soft vocals. But. <laughs> and that's just a really... I don't think the whole song about that line is just so impactful if you really think about it. You know, mour mourning for those who have never met someone that you knew was, you know, important. But yeah, in my opinion, this song is, uh, you know, obviously it's hard to say there's anything wrong with songs like End of Heartache, which I probably will be listening to next, or something newer, Kill Switch, to sort of mix it up. But, you know, there's certain songs that are just perfect, and this is one of them, I think. Can't have anything bad said about it. <laughs> 